iPhone 6 dock connector uh, damaged. So I'm going to replace this puppy and these things are a pain in the butt. I'm going to charge 100 bucks for this puppy because they suck. I hate doing them. And I will charge just because I hate doing them. Um, so, low melt solder, paste, what does it melt at? I think it's 183 degrees Celsius, I think. Maybe 138, I don't know, something like that. One of those. So, low melt. Uh, my low melt is jacked up. Um, where is it at? Okay, here it is. So, I'm just going to put it all over here. You can use chip quick if you have that. That melts even lower. I think it's like that's like 58 degrees Celsius. This stuff is a little bit hotter. And, um... You can be somewhat liberal, as I am. Right here. Alright. Time to throw this away. Wipe this off. Put the cap back on my low melt. And. See a little more capped on on it. I don't want to melt this little connector right here. It's got a little plastic on it. So, um, direct the heat away from the battery connector. And, uh, I think I'm at 315 again, but you can go a little lower probably. So you want the low melt to <laughs> Let me try my tweezers here. See if that helps. So essentially you just want to mix it in with the leaded, leaded solder. There you go. Mix it in. Good. Mix it in. Mix it in. And then blow on it with the hot air. Comes off a lot easier. There you go. I don't think this is mixed in yet. There it goes. Easy pakeasy. Couldn't get the low melt. There he goes. 
Look at this, that's gone. Um, so let's get the big iron now. Get a little flux up in there. And get all the low melt off. So. <laughs> You don't really want to solder with low melt because it does not um, conduct electricity as well as lead free and leaded solder. All right. Um, let's see. More flux. Some of this brownery, not a big deal since I'm going to use my, um, my tweezers to remove the solder. All right, low melt gone. Clean up the excess, still gunked up flux. All right. Uh, let's see. Oops. Geez. Okay. All right. That looks pretty good. Unfortunately, I do not have another connector here. Um. So, guy needs it back ASAP. So let's see if I have a donor board here. I'm pretty sure I have a donor six. Here you go. But I've already taken the connector off of that, so I do not have another donor. Um, I don't think I'm pretty sure I don't have a dock connector. I don't. So that is how you remove it. I will come back and uh, solder it back on in another video.